Adika, I'm Grace, and this is my mum, Sue. So Adika is Sue. And today we'll be making green curry. We will start from the green curry plate first. Mm -hmm. okay. So we'll just go get that prepared. My well, mom's just cutting the ingredients. Yeah, we nearly ready. We nearly did. Look, we nearly ready for only two on garlic. Peel, only left. two garlic. You know, you not use the hand like that. They look, look, use the knife like that. Here you go. And oh. Peel it out. Here you go. Try. Okay. Uh huh. That's easier. Peel out. Here you go. <gasps> when we cut everything, now you put everything in. Yeah. I just cleaned off the garlic. Okay. Oh, can you smell that? Oh, oh, that smells so actually nice. really nice. <laughs> nice and fresh, isn't it? Uh -huh. huh? No! Oh, put it in. Yeah, we put everything in. And then Here just... you go. Did you see? We will see like a, the brain time you would on on the whole process. They still not. See? They still not really fine, but they can help. We a little bit. So we go to put more in the mortar. Okay? So here we have the motors. Yeah. These are these like kind of pots which you have these things. The stone one for make is a curly paste. Make it really fine. Really yeah. fine, fine paste. But that one, how different, you know? No. Because this one Why? is for like a lightly crust, like a we make for the salad, like a papaya salad. What or about? What that's about? For make it, the bruise and the juice get inside only that. We put everything from here inside there mm -hmm. and here, you see? Uh -huh. And you see, we will put the, that's one. Mm -hmm. What it's in place later in the mortar. We not put in the. Smells pretty blend. bad. We not put in the blend because it's just like a what do you call it make it stuck so we put in the mortar pose it mm -hmm. including some salt yeah we have salt as well and we start crunch it mm -hmm. so just to let you know be safe when you're working with mortars because you could accidentally hit yourself with it or drop Yep. You have to also be careful by whenever you're storing your motor. Yeah. Mm, here we mm. you don't need to go to the gym yeah. good exercise. <laughs> yeah. As I was saying, mm -hmm. when you want to store your motor or even use it, you have to put it on a mat mm -hmm. or just like a cloth so that it doesn't damage your table. Uh -huh. That's good. Good tip. Mm -hmm. That's it. We will do work until them smoothly.